So in this tutorial, what I'm going to do, show you how to do is create a simple Python program that you can type in your terminal and it will send a tweet for you. So say for example, um, you like to, you want to use your keyboard to send tweets um, instead of using your phone. It is a simple way. All right, so what you want to do is you want to create a new PyCharm park, new PyCharm project, excuse me. And we're going to name it just, let's just call it Twitter. So while that loads up, So what we're going to want to do is we're going to create a new Python file. Let's just call it um, tweet. All right. And so the first thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want to import Tweepy. Um, let's see. You want to install it. So you're going to want to right click, just install packages. Let's take a second here. Just installing it down there. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to create your consumer consumer key um, you're going to want to create your consumer secret Then you're gonna to want to create your access token, and I'm hoping that you already know how to get these. Um, I guess I'll create another tutorial if the demand is there. Um, but I'm assuming you know how to get your access tokens from Twitter. Um, just go to Twitter or go to Google. Type in Twitter apps. Uh, to go to your developer Twitter account, log into your account, and it'll give you tokens. Um, there's also many tutorials out there. Um, so, all right, what we're going to do is we're going to want to do is we're going to authenticate to Twitter. So sometimes too, with when you're writing Python, Python code, you want to just leave little notes. Uh, makes it easier to understand. So what we're going to do is we're going to create auth. And we're just going to use tweepy, um, dot o auth handler. And so I'm going to pause the video and I'm going to put in my API, or I'm going to put in my tokens real quick. We're going to want to set our auth handler equal to our key and secret. So let's do, what we want to do is set this to consumer, sorry, key, and then consumer secret. Um, big side note, don't put commas here. Do not, um, because it'll leave you frustrated and wondering why is this code not one running, and you'll be upset. Um, that's what I did, so watch out for that pothole. Just letting you know. All right, and then so what we're gonna want to do is we're gonna want to set our auth to our token, and what we're gonna want to do is we're gonna want to access our token here. So let's just type in access, and then our token secret. Okay, and so what we're going to want to do is we're going to create an API object. All right, and that's just API equals Tweepy um, dot API auth. Okay, and then what we're going to want to do is we're going to create a tweet. Um, with input and so what this input will allow is allow you to type in the your tweet and then send the tweet and so what we want to do is we're gonna want to write a print function and write enter what you would like to tweet Okay, 
And then what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to create an input. Let's call it X. And whatever that input will be, we will want to API. Well, what we want to do is we want to update the API. Um, let's see, update status. Yeah, status. Okay. And what we want to do is we want to update it with our input. So whatever input was in here, now that we labeled it as a variable, whatever this variable will be, we'll update to our stat, our, to our API. And then so what we want to do is, is we'll write just a printout for our own eyes, is print you tweeted x. All right. And so we'll save that. Okay, so we have our keys, token, secret. All right, let's run this tweet. So we go down here and write run. And we'll reject the tweet. Um, let's see. I, I would like to tweet. Make sure to check out the weekend's new album. Okay, it says you tweet, make sure to check out the new Weekends album. Um, I'll show you in the screen real quick. That tweet is there. Um, but that's really it. That's really all you have to do. You just gotta grab your consumer key, secret, your access token, your secret, and then just plug it into a simple Python environment and run it. Um, maybe I'll do some other Python stuff with Twitter if anybody else wants any other stuff. Um, I'd like to support